Hi Fire Signs, Leo, Aries and Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking, sharing and subscribing. I really appreciate all of your love and support in this reading. For those of you who have social media, we're going to find out who has been obsessively uh, stalking your social media and why. Today is the 3rd of August 2023 time here in Hoi An, Vietnam is 9.54 a.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Leo, Aries and Sagittarius. If you were to finally got it to watch this video, this message is meant for you even if you're dealing with the same sign. Sorry, I just need something really spicy. Um, so bear with me. <laughs> Spirits and angels, please to show me for Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius who has been obsessively stalking them and why. If you don't have any social media, this is not the reading for you, okay? Page of Swords in reverse at the bottom of the deck. So this is definitely a stalking card, right? When the page is in upright, I usually say spying. In reverse, I say stalking. So this is really uh, hardcore stalking, right? Seven of Cups feels like maybe this person doesn't know something, or wants to find something out, or trying to figure you out. Ace of Cups, this could be someone um, either new in your life or this is someone who still loves you, okay? Who cares about you, who loves you. Or trying to figure out your love life because these cups can indicate love, right? And then we've got the Ten of Swords here in one first. This is perhaps someone... Either you have released or they may have released you. There was an ending between the two of you. Um, hmm. Very painful ending. Maybe they're stalking you because they want to see if you have a new love. Yeah, Ace of Cups. Can you keep that? Two of Cups. This person still loves you, still cares about you. That's why they're stalking you on your social media. But Two of Cups also can indicate a relationship, right? Uh, friendship, relationship, partnership. So this person could be obsessively stalking you because they want to see who you're with. They're together, right? Who are you with? Or whether it's romantically or not. Who, who have you been hanging out with? Who are you associating yourself with? What did you eat? What did you drink? Where did you go? Because <laughs> these are cups can indicate food and drinks, right? Three of Wands, here's a one first. So this is possibly someone you've turned your back on. That's why they could be obsessively stalking you. Just as some of first. I feel like maybe this is someone who didn't treat you right in the past, unless it's vice versa. Something wasn't fair in this situation, in this connection. And the chariot here is in love first. So this is a stuck energy. I do sense this person feels kind of stuck. Um, they want to move forward with something, but they can't. So they're trying to figure you out. Seven of Cups. This is also a very confusing energy. So this person who could be stalking you, obsessively stalking you right now, could be confused about what's going on with you with your life who are you with again and then we've got the ten of wands here in one first maybe there's someone you've released you got two tens here in one first unless this person still hasn't quite released you yet okay and this is why they could be obsessively stalking you eight of pentacles here is in one first Possibly wanting to figure out what have you been working on, what have you been focusing on. Um, but this also, this could also mean that this is someone you may have stopped focusing on, right? You're confusing them right now, Seven of Cups. Hmm. Again, maybe you've turned your back, you're not focusing on them. Or that they could be trying to figure out what are you doing with your life, with your work, your work life, your love life. I see that as well. But uh, for some of you, there's a little bit of this energy that I'm picking up on because of the justice here in my verse. 
For some of you, someone may be obsessively stalking you because for legal reasons, okay? Spare that in mind. Uh, that's for some of you. For legal reasons. Could be after the force or like... um. But I don't see this... I feel like it could be someone who has like betrayed you already in the past. Okay, but there is something about injustice here with the justice in one first. Definitely there's someone who is spying on you for because of legal reasons, okay? Bear that in mind. I'm going to pull out a few more cards here. I'm actually feeling a little bit sleepy because I had pho, <laughs> Vietnamese food, and it was such a big portion and now I'm getting a little bit sleepy, but I'm still okay. <laughs> Five of Swords in my first, and we've got the King of Wands. So the King of Wands is you, unless it's them. If it's them, then it could be a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. So the King of Wands, look at how intently he is, how focused he is, right? Looking at something, keeping an eye on something. So I would say that this person is very driven, very passionate. They really want to see something about you on your social media. For a lot of you, this is someone, maybe they're still passionate about you, or you could still be passionate about this person, you could go vice versa, but um, somehow I feel like maybe you also may have been wondering how this person has been, right? I see very clearly that you have someone you were romantically connected to, but both of you are separated right now, and I see them really want to find out if you have a new person. Unless you already have a new person in your life, they want to see more. They're curious, right? Five of Swords of first could be someone who was manipulative or someone who played mind games or someone who was very selfish and you may have told them i don't want to play this game anymore i don't want to be a part of this anymore i'm done it's a defeated energy right a sense of defeat so but i feel like maybe they've been doing this for a while and maybe this is someone who has confused you at one point in time and then in the end kind of made you feel betrayed. Ending was very painful. Yeah, I keep seeing, see all the cups here. Cups get any options, love options, right? So you have a, a past lover, a past person who is very interested to see who you're with right now. Who are you hanging out with? Especially romantically, if you have a new boyfriend or new girlfriend or new wife or new husband. Hmm. And then we've got the Ace of Wands here in my first, King of Swords, Eight of Swords in my first, Queen of Pentacles in my first. You have two kings here. For some of you, maybe you have a couple of people obsessively uh, spying on you there's one here whom could be a libra gemini or an aquarius as well unless it's the same person both kings here could belong to the same person um information right swords indicates information or who have you been communicating with the comments replies <laughs> so eight of swords here is in the first maybe they've been thinking a lot about you and they feel rejected by you or you, either you've rejected them or they may have rejected you this was a connection that started off very passionate strong chemistry but it didn't take off okay for some reason maybe you've cut them off or maybe they've cut you off but the king of swords is also a very strategic king some of you maybe this person is strategizing that could be one of the main reasons why they could be obsessively stalking you. They're planning, they're strategizing, or they're just collecting information, trying to find out, trying to see what are you doing? Do you have another lover? Do you, if you already have, how do they look like? Most likely you are not focusing on this person right now. 
Queen of Pentacles and Mount Force, you're not really invested. I see both of you are separated. But the Two of Cups here, yeah. I see the Two of Cups here as you being with someone else. So they are definitely obsessively stalking you because they want to see who you're with. Who you're with. Who are you with? <laughs> romantically all right fire signs leo aries sagittarius this is your reading hope you resonated in some way shape or form if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm open for personal readings if you'd like to book me my information is in the description box below feel free to subscribe to my other channel it's called chelsea vlogs it's my travel channel and for those of you who like to be notified every time when i post your videos and every time when i go live don't forget to hit on the bell notification button take care bye